today we are going to expose the digestive system of frog. Digestive system of frog contains digestive glands and elementary canal. Digestive gland consists of liver and pancreas. An elementary canal of frog consists of buccal cavity, esophagus, stomach, small intestine, large intestine, and cloacal aperture. Frog belongs to class amphibia and it is vertebrate. So it is dissected ventrally. To begin the dissection of a frog, we need a freshly preserved frog, a pair of bent scissors, a pair of normal scissors, a paintbrush, a pair of forceps, and a needle. The frog is laid on the dissecting tree and two pins are inserted into the pair of hind limbs. Two pairs into the forelimbs and one at the tip of its mouth. We start from a small incision near the cloacal aperture to the lower jaw. Now we cut the flaps of the skin near the hind limbs and the forelimbs to expose the frog more distinctly and we pin them down and we do the same on the other side and now you can see the intestines of the frog more clearly. Now we can expose the digestive system of the frog. After lowering the lower jaw we can see the buccal cavity and the bifid tongue of the frog. After going down into the system, we see the esophagus here and on the right side of the system of the frog, we see the stomach and around it, we see the three lobed liver. After uncoiling the intestines of the frog, we see the rectum and the anus which leads to the cloacal aperture right near the end of the system. The esophagus pushes food down the gullet into the stomach. Near the stomach, at the junction of the stomach and the small intestine, we see the pancreas. Around this area, we see the three lobed liver also. Finally, we see the large intestine lead into the rectum and then into anus and then finally into the cloacal aperture.